The news comes to you compliments of the National Bank of the Virgin Islands and Digicel, Cyril B. Romney Tartola, Peer Park and Agico Insurances, Banco Popular, Simply Secure, and NV Salon, Spa, Nail and Barbershops. You value traditions. To You value music. You value education. Family. I love you. <laughs> Service. Thank you. You're welcome. Love. Life. At Popular, we're committed to you and everything our community values. For the things you value the most, count on us. Popular. Stop. 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 Think. Think. Before you act. Before you act. Think before you act. Speaker of the House of Assembly, Honorable Julian Willock, has not laid to rest the issues he has taken seriously with the Commission of Inquiry, Sir Gary Hickenbottom, to the extent that he has penned the missive to the United Kingdom Secretary of State for Foreign, Commonwealth and Development Affairs and the First Secretary of State, Dominic Raab, calling for an investigation. In a letter dated July 8, 2021, Honorable Willock cited Commissioner Hickenbottom's alleged refusal to allow him to present new evidence showing that he was not in violation of the Registrar of Interest Act. Honorable Willock also alleged bullying on the part of Sir Hickenbottom, stating that on June 18, 2021, the Commissioner's approach towards him as the head of the legislative branch, quote, was extremely condescending and tantamount to bullying. Now, according to Honorable Willock, Sir Hickenbottom has also allegedly shown a general disregard for the legislature and elected members of the House of Assembly by calling them to appear as witnesses and to testify on days when they had scheduled House of Assembly sittings. Willock also cited allegations of sexism, alluding to treatment meted out to complaints commissioner Mrs. Erica Smith-Penn and Sarah Jane Knox of Withers. During their appearances before the Commission of Inquiry. Honorable Willock, in his letter to Honorable Rab, questioned the integrity of Commissioner Sir Gary Hickenbottom, amongst other th issues. Several of these issues were ventilated during a recent press conference called by Honorable Willock in the presence of his legal counsel, Attorney Richard Rowe of Silk Legal BVI. Now, Honorable Willock could not be reached up to press time to confirm whether or not he has received a response to the issues put to Honorable Rab. Earlier this week, though, he did say that he has received confirmation that his letter was received. With this JTV News update, Kathy Richards. We know that where you choose to bank matters, and it is your vote on what your funds do in strengthening our community. As your official bank of paradise, we invest and support the lifeblood of our economy by helping in the realization of personal goals for homeownership, education, and entrepreneurial visions, which support small businesses. We make it our place to connect with persons and worthy causes, and we have been doing so for more than 30 years. Where your money goes and what your dollars empower are your choice. And we thank you for choosing us, a bank that gives where it matters the most, for you, for our community, and a happier tomorrow. The National Bank of the Virgin Islands. Stop. 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 Think. Think. Before you act. Before you act. Think before you act. You value traditions. To You value music. You value education. Family. I love you. <laughs> Service. Thank you. You're welcome. Love. Life. At Popular, we're committed to you and everything our community values. For the things you value the most, count on us. Popular. Our reliance on digital systems has opened new vulnerabilities to sophisticated cyber attacks. Simply Secure's security management solution helps overcome these challenges. Our service includes 24-7, 360 degree protection, for all computers and servers with automatic restoration, security audits, and penetration testing. Don't wait for disaster to strike. Contact us at info at simplysecuregroup.com.